Mother Russia. <laughs> I'm a bit neglectful of my duties. Perhaps I will uh, wander just a bit and see if I can find something interesting. Oh, little rat. I've had practice on you. Ah, you like it? I think we're getting pretty good with this thing. I don't need meat. I don't need meat! I said I don't. Hound meat. Oh no. no. Throw these away. Eight pounds of rat meat. Caldera. Almora. We have missed the sign for Molag Mar completely. <laughs> ah. I wish it really mattered more to me. I should like to see more of this country. Quite nice. This part of the, the world, it grows on me. There are no mushrooms. A bit of wetness is okay. The road here is almost dry. Mm. I do keep hitting these fell things. But we shall ignore for now. I've also been failing at gathering just a little bit. Caldera. I think that I could settle here for just a little while. Perhaps complete a couple of favors. And uh, we'll find our way back someday. <laughs> uh, I go where the wind takes me, you see. Curiosity is a healthy thing. You should nurture it. But patience is the healthy thing as well. Oh, there are kitties here. Shrank shovel. What kind of place is this? Interesting. Are you Mr. Shank? I am Shank. Publisher of Shank Shovels here in Cardella, Caldera. We rent beds and I have a limited selection of goods. Well, this is an inn, is it? It's quite an interesting name for an inn, indeed. You see what I did? Indeed? Ah, oh, you don't like me yet, but you will. Thank you very much, Mr. Shank. I suppose it is good to know this place. This guy's just standing at the town square. You the town idiot, Ned Halis? First time to Caldera? It's a piece of the Western Empire right here in Morrowind. Prosperous little town, thanks to the Caldera Mining Company. If I could be of help in any way, let me know. What is the Caldera Mining Company? Caldera Mine Company is chartered by Emperor, the Emperor to extract the ebony ore from rich underground deposits here. Interesting. Do you know of any rumors? 
House Redoron's really steamed up about the Caldera land grab. They say Caldera's in their territory and they should have gotten the charter. Worse yet, they say Halalu is skimming the top off the Imperial Fat Cat Company that got the charter. Since it's Imperial Company, Redoran can't even get a house war contract on it. When it come to violence, you mark my words. I, uh, might mark them. I do have a journal that I consult you quite often. You want something, friend? A trader, yes. Maybe we can get some pulgrims of our own. Ah, uh, magical implements you have. Short blade, blunt weapon. Hmm. Ooh, amulet of mighty blows. This might be good for my sword skill. And do you know? Amulet of recall. Your price for this is quite good. Ring of Lightning Bolt. Cross Mirror Robe. Ring of Aversion. Ooh. Invisibility with this ring. Quite interesting. I cannot afford this robe at the moment, though I do have eyes for it. For now I will take your accessories and be on my way. see here invisibility ring amulet of mighty blows perhaps he will buy this dark brotherhood junk that I have ah wonderful shoes pauldrons there, now we have quite a bit more gold to work with, no? Hmm... Velos Robe. Allows you to recover health. Oh, I'm having quite a good time here, in this little shop. Hmm... Well... I think we shall wait on this robe for now. I think selling the Dark Brotherhood's things will give me a good amount of gold. I cannot afford this transaction. Oh lord. You can't, can you? How about this? Just give me all the gold you have. Goodbye. <laughs> I think I rather like this place. Making some quick money. I'm listening. And not talking, so I don't understand why you're listening. Oh, who's yelling over here? Let's just have a bit of a look around. The armor. Okay. Maybe I can sell you some things as well. Hotless mode. Are you looking for someone? No, sir. Please barter with me. I have these boots I have found. And the curious. It's quite curious, this curious. Get it? See what I did? I'm not here to impress you anyways. Hmm. Cauldron. Heavy armor. I'm not looking for heavy armor. I think I will just sell you these things and be on my way. Wonderful! I wonder should we turn back and go to Moloch Mar? Hmm. This seems such a nice little town. I hate to leave it this quick. Pawnbroker. Hmm. Let's see if I can get a fair price. I don't think I've seen you in Caldero before. Indeed, you haven't. You're the pawnkeeper. Maybe you know some rumors. House Redoran. I I know about House Redoran. Thank you. Uh, secret? 
Daedra? No, I know about Daedra as well. How about some advice? Caldera's a quite law-abiding town. Not much call for venturers or mercenaries here. Good place to shop for equipment and look for a trainer, though. Yes, I did find that. It's quite a, a nice selection they have here. What is your selection like, my friend? Boy, short blade. Shadow weave. Mm -hmm. Well, I think not for now. Goodbye, my friend. You have been quite nice. Oh, oh. Got some silver, have you? Speak freely, friend. I need you to leave, please. to grab these things. Can you see me? Short blade. Heavy armor. Hmm. Ah, they're watching me far too closely. It's impossible to pick anything up in here. Excuse me, guard. Jeez. Not a bit of help around here. Perhaps I am done shopping? Cloth the year. Guild of Mages. Ugh. No, thank you. There's a home, and another home, and the guard towers. Let's see what says this sign. Aldrun, Caldera Mining Company. Perhaps we shall continue down this path. I've heard many things about Aldrun, and I'd like to see it for myself. Now I am not so scared to uh, go adventuring. I've conquered quite a couple things with my sword. Hmm. Just a little bit of this for me. And that. Hmm. Maybe I should eat some of these ingredients. And figure out. Do you hear the dogs? I hate them. Oh, look at this a naked man standing by the side of the road. Not the most welcome change from the buxom maidens I've been meeting. A low more wine sought. So let's hear it. Hello and well met, stranger. As you can plainly see, I require some assistance if you be kind enough to grant it. I need help finding the festering witch who's robbed me blind and left me for dead. What is this witch, my friend? A witch she had to be. I was on my way to Caldera when I met her. She was a stranger here like myself, and our conversations lightened the burden of travel. She was quite friendly and, well, you know, we set up camp together. But that night she revealed the witch inside. Cast a spell on me. I couldn't so much as blink. Stole everything. Even my worn out clothes. But most importantly, she took my prized axe, Cloud Cleaver. Join with me, stranger. Let's find her and ex extract her entrails together. Well, that is a lot more th than uh, looking for love. I suppose I shall help with this. I knew you had the bloodlusting, you stranger. I believe she's still camped where I left her up northwest. Though I could be wrong as the spell disoriented me a bit. It did. You know, this area way better than me. Lead the way. This witch shall rule the day she met with Halomar Rhineswat. Well, I really don't know the area better than you, but, uh... We shall give it a try. Hmm? Northwest, you say. Hope it's not too hard, nor Northwest.
Here we go, off the road, towards some adventure with a naked man and his face paint. Quite interesting. Don't know why one would decide to paint one's face. I hear something. Do you hear it as well, Mr. Winesot? Perhaps he is just a drunkard and he is leading me off the road to get robbed. Uh, but, uh, I think he will learn better, if that is the case. What is up here? Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. We are now walking inside the scar. I hear more foul things. My goodness. We had better be careful. More of those flying things. It grows dark and windy, Mr. Hulescar. Are you fine? Into the western cache we go. Pull your your mail over your face. Not as good as a shirt, but it should help. Caldera, Balmora, Nisus, Malagmar, Malagan, Aldrun, Margon, no Malagmar. We shall go to Eldrune, I think. I am keeping an eye out for this witch. But maybe I'm being told some tales. I can't be too sure. Hmm. What is this? I see a glow in the distance. Give him. You're dead what is it? A oh, little rat. Had quite enough practice. Look at this. So sad when that happens. Wonderful. So now we shall see if uh, the light over here was just a figment of my imagination, perhaps a reflection from some pond water. At least I can count on my good friend Hariskar here. He's not afraid to punch a rat to death in defense of me. I think it is quite nice to have a trowel. Seems I was imagining this. There are some creatures here. But, uh. Let us see what they can do in combat. Might be good to level my blade skill just a bit more. No? Well, there's many of them. Do you think they are unfriendly? Maybe not. Maybe someone lives in this cabin. Are you a friend? Shit, my sword. And welcome, friend. So, Jobar Horsemouth, I know of you. You are uh, with the Fighters Guild, no? Master at Arms is my trade. I'd be happy to share a little advice or more wind lore with the fellow Blade. Or perhaps you prefer to catch up on the latest rumors. Yes, do you know of any good rumors? I monitor smuggling along the bitter coast, and the job's too big for me. 
They move moon sugar, skooma, rye ebony, dwemer artifacts, you name it. Through Halaloa to Nomar and Narmok, with the coast co honeycomb with smuggler caves and Karmanatong, locals carrying tiny packages overland by night, I'll never catch them. Maybe you'll have better luck. Hmm, indeed. Perhaps you could tell me about, uh, some training. What do you offer? Long blade, blunt, and axe. Quite good. If I need some other proficiencies, I shall be back. Thank you, Mr. Horsemouth. This is quite a nice little place he has here. Let's see what he has inside. Why not? Wood. That's what I said, man. Common shirt. Mm hmm. Well. Not the best. This is quite a humble little place. But, um... If it helps me stock up on alchemical supplies, I suppose I can't sniff too much. No? And a little gold as well, to top it off. Come, Mr. Halomar. I called you Hariska earlier. I don't know why. Don't trust them. Why? Perhaps this is like the pack animal? Out here in the marsh? A reptile is much better than a bug. We have humanoid reptiles. Humanoid bugs. Not a thing. I wonder if we should reach Aldrun. I get quite skeptical once I've been on the road for too long. My brain starts to think that maybe we shall never reach our destination. Do see another signpost. Perhaps this will give me some enlightenment. Balmora and Caldera back this way. Narmok and Halal Old. Aldrun and Nisus. Well, we continue on this way. I wish there would have been some things for me to do. In Caldera, unfortunately. Oh, hello, Pond Leaper. Rasha. Ah, yes. What is it, Mr. Mother Rasha? <laughs> Greetings, traveler. Rasha wishes you well and thinks you maybe can help him with some pressing business. And what is that, friend? Yes, most pressing. I have, you see, a shipment of clothing. Fine clothing, it is. To get to Aldrun, but I fear other business throws me away. Perhaps, I think, you and I might come to an arrangement, yes? If you deliver Russia's shirts, these fine, fine shirts, to Bivel Tenahan, the clother in our room, she will pay you for your services, and a generous woman she is. I would ask that you swear an oath to Xenathar to seal our arrangement. Yes? What do you think of my offer, hmm? I swear to Xenathar that I will deliver this shipment. Most excellent, yes, we will both gain from this. I shall keep my good name, and you shall benefit from Tenran's generosity. Wonderful. Take care, Brandar. One should not take an oath sworn to Xenathar lightly. No, never lightly. Five exquisite shirts. Well, I do thank you, sir. Enjoy your time out here, alone. Well, now we are caught in the middle of the night. Hmm. One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again.